Good morning. This is the Global Stock Investor Show. Welcome, global investors. Uh, before I jump into this uh, episode, um, real quick, as you can see, uh, there's an error loading the chart, but um, I looked at the chart on my phone and um, negative 9%, um, which I'm down. Ooh, neg to be exact, negative 9.26%, and I'm down $420. So, I mean, this is pretty much, wow. Um, but, uh, you know, I know this is part of the, the, the market. So, basically, the way I look at it is pretty much it's a cleansing of the market. So, I mean, for next time, for another down market like this, I mean, it's probably best for me to start buying companies while it's in the red like this. I mean, wow. If I would have had me had, you know, money set aside, like right now, look look how low Google's going. You know, I mean, they're just dropping. They're dropping. This is the perfect time to buy a company. So, I mean, learn lesson. This is my first year. Uh, my goal this year was to hit 50 companies. I'm now at 59. And we still have about a week left in this year. So next year, I already, I'm already shooting for my goals for next year, which is another 50 to hit 100. Um, I plan on treating myself this time, something different. Um, once I hit 100, I'm thinking about uh, taking a two-day vacation to Hawaii. Uh, me being a veteran, uh, disabled, that I'm able to fly for like $20. So, you know, something to treat myself because I'm still building. Um, you know, putting in the work, doing these videos. Right now, I have at, I'm in uh, South America and Colombia. Um, my allergy right now is just is bothering me, so that's one thing I'm still pushing through. Uh, got a stuffy nose, so just bear with me. So let's jump into it. Um, this episode is going to be the energy sector, part six. Uh, the first energy company is Cree. Okay, let's go to the five year. Okay. Baseline and a little upward trend. Uh, market price about $40. About Cree Incorporated operates as an innovator of lighting class light emitting diode LED products. Lighting products and semi semiconductor products for power and radio frequency RF application. It operates through the following segments. Wolf speed, LED products, and lighting products. The wolf speed segment pro products consist of silicone carbide, SIC, and gallium nitrate, GAN materials, power devices, and RF devices based on silicone, SI, and wide band gap semiconductors materials. The LED product segment includes LED chips, LED components, and SIC materials. The lighting product segment consists of LED lighting systems and bulbs for the commercial, industrial, and consumer markets. The power and RF products segment includes power devices and RF devices. The company was founded by Calvin H. Carter Jr., John W. Paul Palmore, F. Neil Hunter, Eric Hunter, and John Edmond in 1987, and is headquartered in Durham, North Carolina. Uh, the current CEO is Greg A. Lau. Employees, about 67,000. Headquarters, 6,700, I should say. Headquarters, Durham, North Carolina, founded 1987. Market cap, 4.12 billion. Dividend yield, zero. Um, buy 50 percent, hold forty two percent. Those two together, which gives you more than seventy five percent. So that's the first energy company that I'll purchase. Uh, the second energy company is British Petroleum. Okay, British. Let me look at the five year. Okay, as you see the upward trend. Market price about thirty seven dollars. Oh, this looks like a nice one. Gold, 
Global Stock Investing right here about BP PLC operates as an integrated oil and gas company worldwide. It operates through three segments, upstream, downstream, and Rosneft. The upstream segment engages in the oil and natural gas exploration, field development, and production, midstream transportation and storage and processing and marketing and trade of natural gas, including liquefied natural gas and power and natural gas liquids. It also owns and manages crude oil and natural gas pipelines, processing facilities and export terminals, and LNG processing facilities, and transportation, as well as NGL extraction business. The downstream segment refines, manufactures, markets, transports, supplies, and trades in crude oil, petroleum, and petrochemical products and related services to wholesale and retail customers. It offers lubricants and related products under the Castro, BP, and Aerial brands to the automotive, industrial, marine, and energy markets, and petrochemical products such as purified ter terapiflatic acid. Oh, that was a difficult one. Uh, par Paralaxilene acid satic acid, olefins, and derivatives, and specialty petrochemical products. The Rosneft segment engages in the exploration and production of hydrocarbons in the United States, Canada, Vietnam, Venezuela, Brazil, Algeria, the United Arab Emirates, Turkmenistan, and Norway, and offers jet fuel, bunkering, bitumen, and lubricants. It also produces bioethical, bioethanol, sugar, and biobutanol. Exports power to the local grid. Transport hydrocarbon products through shipping and catering services. BP was founded by William Knox Darcy on April 14, 1908. Wow, it's been around. And is headquartered in London, the United Kingdom. Global Stock Investing. So this is pretty much... It's been around since the 1900s, and it's uh, a company in London. Uh, the current CEO is Robert W. Dudley, employee, 74,000 headquarters, London, United Kingdom, founded in 1909. Market cap, one, $125.93 billion. Dividend yield, 5.66. That's high, more than a three. So that's definitely uh, one to shoot for. Grab that ASAP. Buy 75%. Hold 22%. Those two together, more than 75. So that's the third. Uh, excuse me. That's the second uh, energy company. The third energy company is Solar Edge. Okay, let's go to the five year. Okay, it's a fairly new company, as you can see. Uh, you see the dip here with the upward trend. Uh, market price, $33. About Solar Edge Technologies Incorporated engages in the operation of inverter solutions for the harvesting and managing of photovoltaic solar power. Its products include power optimizer, inverter, and monitoring portal. It offers res residential solutions, commercial solutions, and grid services. The company is founded by Guy Stella, Lior Han Del Delsman, Jove Gallen, Mir Addist, and Amir Fischerblow in 2006 and is headquartered in Hant Hasharan, Israel, Global Stock Investing. Um, the current CEO is Guy Sella, employees a thousand, headquarters in Herzelia, Tel, Tel Aviv, founded in 2006, market cap 1.58 billion, dividend yield zero, buy 70%, hold 20%, those two together more than 75. So that's the third energy company. The fourth energy company is Apache. Okay, let's go to the five-year. 
Okay, it's baselining. Uh, market price, $25. About, Apache Corp operates as an energy company, which engages in the exploration, development, and production of natural gas, crude oil, and natural gas liquids. It operates through the following business segments, the United States, Canada, Egypt, North Sea, and other international. The company was founded by Truman Anderson, Raymond Plank, and Charles R. Naya on December 6, 1954, and is headquartered in Houston, Texas. The current CEO is John J. Kreisman. Employees, about 3,300. Headquarters, Houston, Texas, founded in 1954. Market cap, $10.13 billion. Dividend yield, 2.37. Buy, 23%. Hold, 53%. Those two together, more than 75%. That's the fourth energy company. Last but not least, Holly Burton. Um, a little background before I get into Holly Burton. I work for their company, but um, a subsidiary of Holly Burton, which was called Brown and Root, uh, between 2006 to 2008. So I had a chance to work with the Brown and Root, and it was the first time I got paid. I think I was at the lowest, the high end of people getting paid. What Brown and Root was like 10, 10, 10 to twelve. I was I was at the bottom, so I was getting like seven to eight thousand a month. So great experience. This was in Iraq. I was in the green zone. So what an experience! I remember that. I was a labor foreman. So I pick up the Iraqi nationals and the translator and then pretty much just do work order on the embassy in the, uh, the U.S. embassy in the green zone in Baghdad. So it was awesome. Okay, Holly Burton, let's go to the five year. As you can see, baseline, um, everything's pretty much, as you can see, we're in the downward spiral, bear market. Uh, market price, $25. About Holly Burton company engages in the provision of services and products to the energy and industry related to the exploration, development, and production of oil and natural gas. It operates through the following segments completion and production, and drilling and evaluation business segments. The completion and production segment delivers cementing, stimulation, intervention, pressure control, specialty chemicals, artificial lift and completion services. The drilling and evaluation segment provides field and reservoir modeling, drilling, evaluation, and well bore placement solutions that enable customers to model, measure, and optimize their well construction activities. The company was founded by Early P. Holly Burton in 1919 and is headquartered in Houston, Texas. Damn, they've been around. Uh, current CEO is Jeffrey Allen Miller. Employees, 55,000. Headquarters, Houston, Texas. Founded in 1919. Market cap, $22.64 billion. Dividend yield, 1.47. Buy, 86%. Hold, 11. Those two together, more than 75%. So that's pretty much, that's the fifth energy company. So those five energy companies, to buy all five, the total investment comes out to $164.62. In conclusion, subscribe to the channel, comment any questions or recommendations you have, like if the content was inspiring for you, and share this information with other global stock investors. While you're slaying dragons, I'll be taming them.